if I'll post this. I might just not. I probably didn't make a lot of eye contact. I don't know. Well, hey, it's Hannah. I thought I would do a quick uh, planner supply haul. I have joined the mania that surrounds pretty planning. Um, I just got my Erin Condren Life Planner. There it is, right on the end of my desk. And um, I have not started making pretty pages yet, and I thought maybe getting more supplies would help that. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. I'll just keep collecting supplies. Um, so I went to Joann's, Hobby Lobby, and Walmart. I was on a mission to find washi tape, and I found washi tape. So first, from Joann's, I got four packs, um, and actually a couple of them have two kind of mini rolls in there, and I like that the back of the card shows you what the pattern is, so then if there are words or something on there, you don't have to try to decipher it through the thin little roll of tape. Um, so this one is yellow and white stripes and then a foiled pink chevron. It's not really super chevron on the roll, unless it was just cut kind of crooked. Like, there's a good, a good chevron, but then these are just kind of diagonal stripes. But either way, I thought that was cute. This one is black dots and then uh, blue foil, just regular stripes. This one is glasses, mustaches, and bow ties. I don't know if there's maybe another fancy thing on there. I think it's just the three. And then um, kind of a black and white checkered. And the last one is just a single roll, but it's glitter tape, and I could not be more excited. I thought I was going to have to pay serious money to get silver glitter tape, but this was a dollar. Hooray. I also got a 1 8 hole punch. Um, they had better ones of these at Hobby Lobby with like the rubber the handles, but I'd already bought this one and really the, the price difference, this was on sale, the price difference wasn't big enough for me to go back and swap it out, but if you're looking for one of these that you're going to be using a lot, probably those handles with the covers are more comfortable than just a regular hole punch, but I thought that I could use this to insert things into my Erin Condren planner. Then at Hobby Lobby, I got some craft glue. This is a double-ended, like, glue pen, I guess. It has kind of like a, like a skinny end, and then down here there's a thicker end for gluing down big stuff. Um, I mostly bought it for the skinny end, and I don't want to just go buy a bunch of glue sticks. Um, but I thought this was pretty nice. The packaging does say that it sets in 10 minutes, which I feel is maybe a little bit longer than if I'd just gotten, like, gel glue instead of liquid. We'll see. Uh, and then more washi tape. I got this set of, like, five... Rainbow colors, um, they're pretty bright. They are a little bit muted, um, which I think will go with the Erin Condren setup. Not crazy neon, but they are really pretty. I'm excited about those. I got this two, this is a ton of tape. So much. Like it's 10 yards each, which I will probably never use. That's like 30 feet each. Is that right? Math. <laughs> so uh, there's this like multicolor diagonal stripe and then this one just says hi, hello. Um, so I thought those were pretty cute. I don't know what I'll do with this white tape that says hello on it, but something. I also got this set, which I'm really excited about. It's super cute. I don't know if it necessarily fits the Erin Condren aesthetic, but... I'm gonna make it work. Uh, there is kind of a vintagey, like floral 
bird pattern. Not really a huge fan of birds, to be honest, but I thought that was just too cute. And then there's, I don't even know what color that is, like gray teal, greel, I, whatever. <laughs> it's like a greenish kind of gray blue thing, but and it has kind of like it's a like a mismatch print it looks a little distressed it's got uh like polka dots and then also like maybe dictionary print like you know like excerpts from the dictionary on it I don't I thought it was pretty cool and then the last one is just a pale pink that kind of complements these two ties the set together last thing from Hobby Lobby it's a totally Im unnecessary impulse purchase. They were a dollar fifty. I could not resist. They're little mustaches. How could you say I mean, look, how could you say no to that? I I couldn't, obviously, because here they are at my house. Um I don't know about the practicality of these for me because you'd have to put them on your page like this. Like, the clip, I'm not touching it, the clip goes down, so you would, you know, insert your paper. Let me just sneak peek of what I got at the Walmart. Just stick it, I mean, can you tell it's a mustache, or is it just a caterpillar? I, I don't know. Maybe if you, like, bent, oh, yes, just kidding. Gonna use them, no doubt. I love it. I'm gonna just give all my planner pages mustaches. They work. I thought, you know what I thought. Okay, well, surprise, practical use. Otherwise, I was just gonna plan with this stuck to my face. So, I lost it. I, sorry. Okay, moving on. Uh, last thing, no, not last thing. We're getting there. Um, I got a lot of stickers from Walmart. They're so cheap there. I, like 98 cents, really. Um, so I got some... This is, this is Walmart. I got these wide-eyed, shocked-looking animals. I mostly got it for the turtles. Turtles are my favorite. Like, can we just... Come on. It's so cute. But, and then, what is that? A hedgehog? A porcupine? I don't know. Pretty cute. Excited to use those. I also got these um, puffy stickers with some more kind of creepily eyed animals. <laughs> Creepy little, like, this horse is going to get you. Uh, but, I mean, super cute. The teeny tiny bees are what got me. Like, if you put that on a page, would you even see? It's like a search and find. They're just so small. But I thought those were super cute. I got some school ones. I couldn't resist. I I can put these in my teacher planner. I just... I, come on. So cute! I'm really digging, like, the puffy stickers. And they're not... I don't know if you can tell. Maybe they're... They're not too raised. So I feel like if you put these in your planner, it's not going to bulk up too fast. I'm looking directly at myself in this camera, but I should, like, you know, sorry, eye contact. It's an introvert thing. Uh, more school things. They're kind of like, oh, they're glaring really badly. They are kind of foily, like, I don't know. I thought they were pretty cute. I like the little pencil cup. I have a problem with buying sticker sets for one sticker. Then I got these macaroons. I used to really not care about macaroons at all. And I had one. And it was pretty good. And now they're like a thing. Like, putting macaroons on stuff. Um... I thought these were super cute, and of course, I picked a favorite, and it's this pink one with the strawberry on top. But, um, all the other ones are really pretty, too. And again, they're that kind of puffy, but they're not squishy. They're not like foam, I don't think. They're just a little bit raised. 
I got some, I don't even know what to call these. The, oh, they're called Bright Flourishes, which pretty, pretty apt description there. They are literally bright flourishes um, with some flowers. I just thought these were cute. You know, stick in the corner of your planner. I'm taking this pretty planning business one step at a time. I'm not going to be cranking out Pinterest pictures anytime soon. Then I got two pages of these little monsters. I feel like with a couple people, these are kind of like a cult favorite in the planning community. My Walmart had like seven pages of these guys. So uh, I picked them up and they are pretty stinking cute. Like I just, they don't go with the pretty planning aesthetic at all, but who cares? I mean, stick one of these little guys on your planner and you're just going to be happy. Just, it's, he has a mustache. I just can't. I can't. It's so cute. So cute. I got two of those. And then um, I mostly bought these to take to school. I just, Walmart has the coolest googly eyes. Um, and I don't have to worry, they're adhesive, you know, they're stickers. So I don't have to worry about like gluing these little eyes on stuff if we do a craft or just, and they have so many options. They're just precious. And then, you know, you get a little variety on your crafts. They're just, it, they're just adorable. So I picked up three of those um, because I don't ever really want to be without these eyeball stickers. They are just too cute. I also got, so that's the end of stickers. I also got these, um, I don't know, like journal cards maybe. I don't know how much journaling I'm going to do, but just for like a pop of a pattern or a cute color, they're these kind of vintage -y patterned cards. I don't know how to turn this without being super awkward. So there's... You know, I'll just show a couple. Oh, that's not cute. Like, love you, precious. Authentic vintage goods. It's like vintage, like, fresh squeezed lemonade. Like, vintage picnic kind of stuff. Um, they're just some really cute, cute cards. Like, there's a little bicycle on the back. Or, no, on another one it says, life is lovely. Like, just... Just cute stuff. I like it. I approve. So I'll probably use those. Maybe I'll just glue them into my planner. Or I'll use my new hole punch and insert them myself. It's getting crafty. Uh, I also got from... Those are from Walmart and they are from the line We Are Memory Keepers. And then they're specific, like... That maybe company we are memory keepers line albums made easy I don't know they're they're called we are memory keepers albums made easy and it comes with just a ton of journal cards I had a, a problem a lot of stickers and journal cards came home with me when I went to Walmart at nine o'clock at night that's what happens so I'm not gonna open this right now but they do show like all the cards on the back so there's some cute patterns there's like do what makes you happy what's that be happy be bright be you hello sunshine embark on adventures i love the like the just the design of that one it's just i love you to the moon and back a lot of cute patterns there are some like pockets they're not actually quite that nice they're kind of like brown paper bag material pockets but um just as functional. So I thought that was really cute. Just, I'm all about the pattern cards. Like, I don't think I will journal my life on these cards, but man, they are cute. I also got another pack of those in different styles. So same company, same line, albums made easy. Um, these ones are a little bit brighter maybe like these are kind of kind of muted kind of vintage-esque and then these ones are bright like there there's some pink floral on there how could I not 
You Are My Sunshine, some cute patterns like, oh, distressed looking polka dots, so precious. Bloom Where You Are Planted, just really sweet things. I feel like I've seen some of these cards or similar ones in people's planners already and there's like sweet little butterflies I just and more pockets. Just really cute stuff. And a card like this with just blank lines, I would use something that's super busy like this. I'm probably not going to write on it. I'm probably just going to stick it in there and like use it as a dashboard or whatever. One step at a time. We'll get there. Uh, that is it for, 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 that is it for my planner supplies. Last thing, bonus, this is from Sam's. It is a 20 pen set of the Papermate Flare pens. I adore these. It's like writing with markers without looking like a child. They're just so good. They have every color from like like burgundy, maroon, gray, brown, caramel, purple, lavender, red, magenta, pink, orange, goldenrod maybe, I don't know, sunshine yellow, lime, regular green, olive green, light blue, dark blue, navy, and black. I just, I can't get enough. So I brought a set of 20. Uh, this was only like $15 at Sam's Club. And normally I think a set of 12 at any other store is about that same price. So really good deal here. I am so happy. I haven't even opened it yet. And just, I mean, it's almost like art. Is that weird? Like I just want to set it up at my desk and display it for a little bit. But I also want to open them and never stop writing. So good! It's so good! See you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye!